Hi guys, so today I'm going to be doing my updated foundation routine for you guys. This is pretty much going to be um, a look to go out in that you want, you know, to look, that you want your skin to look flawless all day. So this is me with absolutely no makeup whatsoever. And let's get started. First, you're going to want to take your favorite moisturizer. I'm just going to use my Neutrogena Healthy Defense. And, oh my god, I checked my nail already. Do you guys like this nail color, by the way? Isn't it gorgeous? Okay, no. Okay. So back to moisturizing. Uh, whichever moisturizer you like to use best is fine. I like to make sure that mine has some SPF in it. I'm going to take... Um, Matt's, Matt's, Max Matte Cream. Just looks like this. I'm sure you guys have seen this in a ton of my other videos. I'm gonna put it all over my T-zone because that is where I get oily. And a little bit on my chin. I only need one little squeeze because a lot of this matte cream goes a long way. Next I'm going to use Elf's um, makeup finishing spray I'm gonna spray it before I don't know I just like to spray it before to kind of prep my skin and I like to spray it after my makeup as well so shake it up and just like one spritz just gonna let that dry so my whole thing now that I'm done prepping um, my skin for my makeup the reason that I do so many steps to prep my skin for makeup is because I do want my makeup to look flawless all day and I like to start with a beautiful, soft, um, matte canvas. Um, I do have oily skin, so, um, I try to use anything that's going to stop, um, oil from messing up my makeup later throughout the day. So, then you're just going to take, um, I'm going to take my dual fiber brush. Looks like this. I'm gonna I'm using Max Pro Longwear and I'm in NC35. I'm just gonna take about two pumps. Just going to move my hair out of the way, dab it in. Kind of start stippling it on. And start going in outer circles. I like to put just a little bit on my eyelids because we do have um, some discoloration and redness. you see I'm all done was completely perfect um, the thing with foundation is you're not using it to cover up blemishes and stuff like that um, that's what concealer is for you're using foundation to um, kind of just make discoloration from your face kind of make everything just one um, solid skin tone and take away um, you know redness and stuff like that so foundation kind of, I guess, is also like a base. Um, next, I'm going to take my NYX concealer in a jar, and I'm in beige. That's what it looks like. And I'm going to take a little concealer brush like this. I'm going to need my mirror for this. I'm just going to pick some up, and I'm going to go right under my eye. bringing it downwards. Um, sometimes I like to use a brush to blend out my concealer, but today I'm, um, I also like, I'm going to just use my ring finger. And the way that I blend it out is just by patting it into the skin. Bringing it down. I kind of do my concealer in this triangle shape motion. I put it under my eyes and then I kind of bring it down in a triangle shape just because it's where um, I'm going to look more 
illuminated. I'm going to take some more and I'm going to go right under my nose because I do have redness there. Then I'm going to take my ring finger and pat it in. So I'm all done covering redness. I'm going to take some more and find any places where I have any pimples or old acne scars. And just use the same patting technique. So that's that for um, concealer. Let me see. Next I'm going to take my MAC Studio Fix powder. And I like, and I'm going to take um, a powder brush, dual fiber. And the reason why I like using the Studio Fix is because it has foundation in it. So it's kind of like I'm adding more foundation to my face but in a powder form. So it gives me a lot more coverage. So I'm going to take that. And I like to just like swoop under my eyes and then blend my way down. And also this powder is really good if you have um, oily skin. So down to my neck. I'm going to get into your hairline. So now that I'm done with my powder, I'm going to take um, some more of my makeup setting spray and I'm going to go in and do one spray. Just kind of let, let that dry on your face. So now I would just go ahead and I would start priming my eyes, do my eyeshadow, and then I would go in and contour my face. And my cheeks and my lips, mascara, eyeliner, all of that good stuff. But this is it for just pure foundation concealer powder, my flawless foundation routine. This is what it pretty much consists of. If I'm going out, if I'm going to an event or something like that where um, I want to stay oily, where I want to stay oily, where I want to stay matte all day and control the oil, this is what I would use. And then after I'm done with like all my eyeshadow and all that, I would go, I would go back in with my makeup setting spray.